So I'm currently in Sydney Airport in Australia. I'm about to check in to my Emirates flight. I'm going on an Airbus A380. It's my first time going on the A380. I cannot actually wait. So buzzing for this. It's just a short flight over to Christchurch in New Zealand, a three hour 15 flight. Flight number is EK412. I know the plane I'm going on already. I've got the registration. So stay with me on this video. I'm going to be reviewing the whole flight. I'm going to economy class, but I've got extra leg room seats. So I cannot wait to fly on this beast. There we are, 8.45, EK412, gate 61, status relax. So let's just go explore the airport until we can go to the gate. Looking around, Sydney has a lot to offer on the high-end shopping market. Take a look at all these shops you can go to in Sydney Airport International. We've got another king coming in. Look at the size of that. So whilst I'm waiting for my flight to come in, because I want to catch the Emirates landing from Dubai, just sat watching them unload this Qantas A380. Look at the size of them. I'm so buzzing to catch this landing in and flying on this in less than two hours. And we've also got Singapore Airlines Cargo 747 landing in. Look at that beast. Beautiful. Here it is, A6 EUV. Plane I am going on to Christchurch. Landing in now. Beautiful. Butter. Well, I'm gutted, it's on gate 61, so you can't get a good photo of it. But there she is, the Emirates A380. Should be boarding soon. Thank you. Thank you. So, see, 80A and 80B is it? So you get a pillow, some headphones, and you get a blanket, which is pretty, pretty good. The wooden trim are really nice, look at this. Wooden trim is nice. Well, the leg room fairly is a lot better than mine. I've got this. Nice to put my legs up there. But you cannot be an extra leg room seat. We've got a little window here. And I've kind of got a window here. Look at the recline the seat, the best recline I've had. That goes back a fair way, but I bet if anyone was behind me, they'd have no room. Pretty decent. <laughs> this is just all the little booklets you get, the safety instructions and the magazine. You only get one magazine to look at.
Queensland. Got some fun.
breakfast was really, really good, really fresh, and it came with a lot of different options. Here I am just buttering away my croissant with a bit of jam on as well. Just onto the yogurt now, this was actually really nice. I also found this interactive map so cool. It tells you your whole flight map and you can click on so many different options, it tells you literally everything. And as you can see here, you can also buy Wi-Fi on the flight. I didn't opt to buy it because it wasn't long enough. I just went for the free messaging one, but. Here is just a glimpse of the beautiful scenery that is in New Zealand, flying over now, I don't know where it was, but all mountainous, so lovely.
And there we have it, lovely smooth landing into Christchurch, just giving you a nice little tour on the way out while the aircraft is empty. Such a massive aircraft, loads of seats, and there's even a little clip of premium economy. And here is just two of the powerful Rolls-Royce engines. Oh, this premium economy. And there we have it, you can see in the background the Emirates A380 just parked up, just come off the plane, had an unbelievable flight. The flight was actually 45 minutes quicker than originally planned, so it was 3 hours 15 it was supposed to be, and it only took 2 and a half hours. The flight was unbelievable, so buzzing to go on the first day of 380, really, really enjoyed it. So yeah, hope you enjoyed this video, the food was really nice, the plane inside is so sleek, all the wooden trim, the surroundings and the toilet as well, just so, so good. Hopefully fly on an A380 again in the near future. Hopefully on the top deck, if you're in a lot of money somewhere, but that's probably never going to happen. Even premium economy would be really nice. But yeah, really, really enjoyed that flight. Um, hopefully get to go on a La Fanza 747 this year or next year and fly to Chicago or something like that, because they still obviously got a lot of queens in the sky still. Or an A340 would be cool. But yeah, hope you enjoyed this video. Like and subscribe for more. And when I walked out of the airport, I was greeted by this absolute beast, C-17 Globemaster, US Air Force.